Welcome back, folks, one and all, to Let's Play Goblins 3. When we last left off, we had a wand, and we know what to do with it, too. We'll use the wand on the helmet, because why not use it to cast spells when you can use it as a leverage device? Ah, oh, jeez. People, it's a magic wand. Also, we can use the wand to get the flint, which will also reveal something very interesting. Ah! <laughs> I am Uriel the Magician. I'm hiding. I've been mugged by four balls. He stole my bag full of magic spells. I'm scared of thinking he will use them. Well, we've got flint now. And we now have a magician who can make sheep out of his magic wand. He will be useful. But for now, let's wreck this man's panpipe. For no particular reason. Because I'm a... Oh. Why do we do that again? He wants me to make another flint using my flint. Well, we have loads of small tubes. Ah. Shall we use the flint on the bark? We shall. We're a bit of a goit, aren't we? Um... Can you do anything with the small tubes? You can make a sheep. Fantastic. If we were to stick the powder in the small tube... And then a wick... On the small tube. It falls instead of sticking. Hmm. Well, how about we use the helmet on the bird line? By the way, I don't think you're getting a new um, thing, by the way. What we do is pick up a small tube, put it there. The unlimited per um, powder we put in there. And then we stick a wick on the dynamite. And then we use the bird lime on it. Now it's sticky dynamite. Flint on stone head. Dynamite on wall. Oh. <laughs> I don't think that plan worked very well. Hmm. It didn't work very well at all, actually. I think we got exploded, is the general rule. Throw it anywhere? We're gonna find out. Which I throw it in the brink now. Yes! Excellent. Do a ginormous hole. I imagine eventually we'll return here. It seems like a place you will inevitably come back to. So let's make some more dynamite. Yep. And we'll put another wick on it. That's why she was grabbing lots of handfuls of dynamite, I imagine. So we could actually make multiple of these things. Oh yes, we can't do it yet, do we actually set it on fire? So let's beam next. Eh -eh. I 
don't think your house, uh, house is looking that good for wear now, Forbalus. Pity you left all the materials here. You have a magic spell book. And yet you require us to get your bag. I don't know. Wizards and their foolishness. Mm, window, wall, door, grate. But I'll get the bag this time. No, no, no. On there. Put it on back. Oops. Uh, that didn't work at all. Can you actually do anything? No, it would seem not. You are quite useless. How are we gonna get your little bag? Can we throw the flint at it? It's worth a go, isn't it? No, you can't. Can Uya do anything with the rock? Stone. There is bamboo underneath, which we could use to make another flute. Ouya is not a materialist. Oh, great. Thanks, Ouya. You're not a materialist, and yet you need your magic bag, do you? That's not, if, is that a material, or is that not a material? Right, let's strike it again, and we'll blow the rock up, shall we? Bamboo is ours! An absolutely tiny bloody piece of bamboo. I might add. No, it's not actually grown yet. We can't actually do anything with this yet. We need the magic bag, too. Can't transform anything without the magic bag. Make another one. <laughs> Try and throw it at the at the wall this time. Maybe this time they'll let me do it. Oh no, we have plenty of gunpowder. We need the we need this. And blow up, to be honest. I'd like to run out of things. Let's throw one at full balance, shall we? Because I'm a goit. A goit's always so dynamite in people. Nah, seems to bounce off full balance's head. Less than useful. But when we come back, folks, we will continue to play Goblins 3. And hopefully by then I'll have figured out how to get the bamboo growing and to get the magic bag. The goblin is so sad. Look at him. He's like, you destroyed my hopes and dreams. I hate you. So until then, folks. Until then.